Good afternoon. I'm Ginger Jeffrey. Topping eyewitness news today. Did you feel the earth move early this morning? An earthquake centered in Niagara County woke up some residents shortly after 12.30 a.m. The U.S. Geological Survey says the quake centered near Olcott. Channel 7's Kyla Igo joins me now with the details. Well, Ginger, if you heard a loud noise overnight or even a rattling of your windows, you weren't dreaming. Officials with the United States Geological Survey confirmed that there was indeed an earthquake in northern Niagara County. The USGS reports a 2.5 magnitude earthquake rattled parts of Niagara County around 12:30 this morning, as you mentioned. They believe it originated five miles east northeast of Olcott, with a depth of about three miles. Now, this quake left the Niagara County Sheriff's Office office flooded with calls overnight with many residents reporting hearing some type of explosion or even a loud boom including residents in the town of New Vane. I was sleeping and about two o'clock in the morning I heard a loud bang and I looked through the, all through the house and the shop and there was nothing. I had no idea what it was. All the windows in my house were shaking, and my granddaughter calls me on the phone, and she was a nervous wreck because she lives in Alcott, New York, and the same thing happened to her. Around 2 o'clock in the morning, I heard this big bang, and I didn't think anything of it, but it was pretty loud. Survey officials are not projecting any aftershocks or further earthquakes to hit the area at this time. Now, a geophysicist who we spoke to on the phone said that it's important for residents to remember that a 2.5 earthquake is considered very minor and that reports of hearing a loud boom are really not that uncommon with these, quote, quick jolt earthquakes. Ginger. Okay, thanks, Kyla. And this is a Facebook topic today. Did you hear or maybe feel that earthquake? Do you have an earthquake story to share? You can join our social network. You can like the WKBW TV page on Facebook. You can also tweet us at WKBW.